Okay, you join us. Uh, we've just missed the start of um, this uh, tournament final, and uh, this for many people is uh, an unusual game. If you've never played Virtual Pool 4 before or, or any of the Virtual Pool games, this game's called Cowboy. And it's only played with four balls, including the cue ball. You've got the three coloured balls, the cue ball. Now each of those three balls score their point value. So the one ball is one point. You'll get five points for the five ball and three for the three ball. Now those are the obvious things about the game. Now what we missed was the break-off shot. Um, the player who's breaking has ball in hand behind the head string and he has to hit the three ball first in the break-off to make it a legal break. He can of course pot the three ball and there are certainly there's actually three phases to Cowboy. It's the first player to reach 101 points uh, who wins the game. The first phase of Cowboy is a phase where you can pot balls and score the numerical value of the balls. So as you can see at the moment, Mr. Bill is on 28 points. He'll be in 31 in a minute once he pots this three ball. But he can actually also play a mixture of shots should he wish to do so. He can play a pot on the one, but he can also carom balls as well, which you might see him try to do on the odd occasion. And you will also get a point for a carom. And if you pot a ball and play it, well there's a carom there for example, so you'll get one point for that, that will take him to 38 and um, we'll explain the next phase of the game once we get there and we're still quite a way off that point at the moment but what we're also uh, um, doing is we're playing on the 10 foot table let's have a look and um, I'm not sure whether that's tight pockets or whether that's tournament pockets but we'll do a quick check and find out Let's just have a quick look. Yeah, the pockets are on tight. So that makes it a little tougher. So Bill's run comes to an end at 41. And Romario um, just got a little bit of catching up to do. So for this first phase, the objective of the game, of each player, sorry, uh, is to reach 90 points. And they can do that by, as I've said, potting a ball and getting a points value. That was a bad miss. Um, they can also carry on balls right up until 90. And you have to get 90 exactly, so you have to concentrate. Sometimes a lot of players get on a, a long run and forget when they get to 90. So that was a short visit by Romario, he only scored 10 points and Bill should not be too far off um, the 90 points by the end of this visit. There's also um, an alternative version of Cowboy within Virtual Pool 4 as well, and it's a much more challenging version. Um, in the first phase between 0 and 90 points, um, it's alternate uh, shot type that you're forced to play. Now, by that I mean 
you can pot a ball, but the next shot has to be a carom. And then the shot after that is a pot, and then a carom, and so on. And that makes it a lot more challenging. Um, and it certainly, it will help improve your game. But uh, perhaps if you're just new to Cowboy, you should play the easier version that these two guys are doing. And also, um, make it a little bit more challenging, play it in the 10-footer, like, like they're doing as well. So, Bill is still on a run of 36. He plays a carom there. He gets the one point, but he's only 12 points away from 90, so let's hope he's concentrating on what he's doing. And this final is just over one game, so it's the first player to reach 101 will be the winner. And the one thing I would say is that uh, the two guys that are playing, they're, they're reasonably okay at uh, the carom side of the game. So once we get to 90, it will be a race um, to complete the next phase of the game, which is between 90 and 100. So Bill sinks the one ball to take him to 88. It looks as if it's just going to be singles he's going to be doing here. The next one takes him to 89, and the final one takes him to the 90 points. Now, I should also point out, if you scratch any time during a run, you will lose all the points. So Bill is still on his run, which is a run of 50, and that carom takes him to 91. So Bill now between 91 and 100 has to keep getting points by only making caroms. And so that's the end of Bill's run. And for Romario to have a chance in this final, he really needs to put a good run here and get as close to that 90 as he can. Because he doesn't want Bill building up a lead uh, in caroms, then it would make life a bit too difficult for him. So we've seen a couple of caroms there, and Romario misses a cut on the five. But this is where Romario still got a fair chance of uh, catching Bill up. Just missed the edge of the five. Now we'll see if Romario can get a bit of concentration together. But really, this position that the balls are in at the moment aren't really suitable for Romario to put a, a decent run. He needs to get them on their spots. And he's got the three on the spot but uh, he would like certainly another one on there. Five's going to go on to the middle spot. He could tidy things up completely by rolling the, the one ball in. And he might try a carom onto the one and he's missed the three again. But one thing to point out here is that three hanging over the corner pocket makes it a lot more difficult for Bill because he's only got the two balls to play with and he got the carom but he actually banked the three ball. So you'll notice in the top right hand corner there it said foul not a carom. So he doesn't get the point. But meanwhile Romario's still chasing and 
He's already had two attempts at putting a run together and failed. And he needs to get better control of the cue ball. And that one is still doing nothing for him on the side rail. But he's getting closer. And we're 12 points behind now. Five comes back on the spot. Romario goes to uh, 85 and this five will take him to 90 but he has to watch. He doesn't run through and collide with the three ball. That would give him six points and be, he'd be over the 90 limit and that would uh, be the end of his run and he would lose all his points. So now both players are in the 90 to 100 phase and so they're both chasing to the 100 points with Caroms. Oh dear, and that's disaster. That's exactly the point it was making there. Romario, his run took him over 90. And he scratched and lost all his points. So he's back down to where he started at 64. And meanwhile, Bill comes to the table, starts off with a carom. Misses the next one. So now Romario's got to work again and he's not got an easy shot here because the one's blocking the five. But he's got a carom and unfortunately scratched off it again. And this time he's left Bill with ball in hand, right behind the five, push the five up the table, or maybe even slide off it and run into these uh, two balls here. So the odds of him getting a carom here are fairly high, or favourable should I say. He decided just to play the three to the one. And should be able to come off the edge of the one onto the three. And now the three's in a more awkward place. He could draw onto it, try and kick it out. He needs to watch he doesn't go behind it and go in off. Well he didn't get he didn't get the shot right there at all. So Bill's on 95, Romario still back there on 64. But um, Romario is usually pretty good at the carom phase of the game, so he's not out of the game yet. He's still got a good chance. And now the five's back in its spot. The one ball next. He should be able to get back up to 90 fairly quickly here. goes to 84 with a spy ball and that's ended up sort of no man's land he's either going to have to try and pot the one and run through onto the five yeah you got the straight straight pot and the one so this five will take him back on to 90 and now he's back to the carom phase again And one thing that you should be trying to do in this phase of the game is to try and gather the balls in a corner or something like that. That's always beneficial in putting a little run together, maybe two or three caroms in a row. But Romario's gifted Bill an easy one there. A 
I played the draw shot from the 3 to the 5 it goes to 97 Well, he could try and come off the edge of the one and send a cue ball down to hit the five, which I think he's accomplished. That was a good shot. Eh, sorry, three ball, not five. So Bill edging ever closer to the 100 mark. And he's got a comfortable lead. Romario seven points behind. Well, he could try rolling through on the five to get the cue ball to hit the three, but he, oh, well, disaster. He scratched again, got the the double kiss on the five and went in off. But he had the right idea in mind. He was taking the cue ball down the side rail to get the carom and the one, which I think he was going to get if he hadn't hit the five again. So again, here's an easy one for Bill. Got it too thick. And Romario needs an easy starter to get his eye in. He's going to be running down the table here off the side rail to hit the five, the three again. Keep calling it the five. He might still get the second prize here. Yep. That wasn't the shot he played, but on missing that five, he's now given Bill another easy carom. So Bill now is at the match point stage virtually, he's on 99. Just needs one more carom. Not quite. And Romario's still in the match because the final phase of the game on this bigger table with the tighter pockets isn't all that easy. And we'll explain that in a second once we get there. And Bill will be on the magic 100 points in a second. Got an easy carom, and if he just rests it very softly, he can leave the one near the pocket. Ah, he got it too heavy. So now Bill's on 100. This is the final phase of the game. And Bill has to nominate a pocket where he, he's going to try and scratch off the one ball. That's the object of this part of the game and as you'll notice it's the toughest part of the game and this is where your opponent can although he's chasing you down if he gets a run together he can be right on your tail any second and Bill is just going to try and run the cue ball through off this one it's a little bit of top on it try and get it at the right angle so he can run the cue ball into the pocket well he's tried to edge it in and I don't think that was ever going to go and these balls are still too far apart to get any sort of three or four run that Romario needs and he needed more English on that cue ball to get over to the three there. And now Bill's got a good opportunity to stun off the one ball. Well, he's trying the he's trying the bank and the in off into the middle. Missed it. I would have thought the other one would have been easier to actually just stun off the one down into the bottom right hand corner. Meanwhile, Romario is back at the table. He moves to 95, only five points behind. And 
this time Bill could run through into the middle, the one at the top of the screen, and that's the one he's nominated. And this looks a reasonably easy shot, just to roll through into the middle pocket. And he's hit the jaw. That was a good chance squandered there. An easy carom for Romario. Oh, and he's got them gathered now, he's got the one and the five. And I'm going to gather again, and this is what I mean. Ah, oh, that might... I think he's okay. I think he can just edge the one and, and clip the five. Ah, uh, but he's gone too straight now. He could try the bank up and down the table and try and split the two of them. He's went for a draw. Is it going to reach? Oh, that was lovely. That was a very good shot. And... That's a run of four, and Romario is on 99. So this match isn't over yet, and Romario moves to the 100, and he's got a nice little thin edge to try and stun. I think he'd need to try and stun the cue ball into this top right-hand corner for the 101 points. He needs to watch the double kiss. That's the difficulty here. Yeah, got it, stunned it too much. But he's got the object ball safe. The one ball's the the object ball for both players now. So two of them are on 100 points, and both of them are trying to scratch off the one ball to win the match. And um, that will be called a foul because Bill played that deliberately to prevent him moving the one out off the rail to give Romario a chance. And the three foul rule is in Cowboy, so if he'd done that another twice he would lose the match. And Romario brings the one out and gets the cue ball as far away as he can. Now, Bill's going to have to dig down into the cue ball and try and stun off the one into the corner. Uh, well, I don't know what he tried there. Let's look at the angle. That he's got yeah he's just trying to oh he's miscued and that could be disaster yeah that's a total disaster he's left Bill the easy in off the one into the middle and that I'm afraid was just because he never checked where his cue tip was in the cue ball so anyway Bill wins the match by 101 points to 100.